Okay, I'm just going to make this video. It's going to be a short video. But uh, right now, I'm at home. And uh, I'm not going to... Well, today is Saturday, so I wouldn't be going to work anyway. But all next week, I'm not going to work because they told me to stay home. They told just about everybody to stay home. So, and also, the governor just made a speech yesterday. He just, um, I guess, made... I don't know what you call it, proclamation or whatever ordering that uh, everybody stay at home unless you can you only go out if you need something if it's essential you know like if you need to go to pick up a prescription or things like they mention also if you want to walk your dog or something like that but just being out for no particular reason you can't do how they're going to enforce that I don't know because they even said, like, if you just need to get out and go for a walk or something, you can do that. But then I'm thinking, what are they going to do? Just, you know, because they say you know, the police could pull you over and ask you questions. And I think what they were su sort of suggesting that, yeah, we're more or less kind of suggesting this. And they're not going to give you a fine or something. But I think in California, they're, they're, I think they're being more strict about it. People will probably be fined. And I think in Illinois, it's kind of like more like a very strong suggestion that you don't go out. And that potentially the police could, you know, give you a fine. I don't think they'll be putting people in prison because even that's an issue now, prisons. Because a lot of people in prison are in situations where they cannot social distance. Plus, there's this issue which I've heard people talk about in prisons. You don't just automatically are given soap, for example. You have to buy it and a whole bunch of other things. And that's important because soap, you need to wash. You need to wash your hands and everything else. But you definitely got to wash your hands. And that's going to be an issue. And if a prison, if one prisoner comes in there infected and infects a whole bunch of people in these close quarters, that's going to be a problem because there are other people who are not prisoners who work at the prison, like the guards and others who are going to get infected. And it's going to become a problem, you know. I mean, we saw what happened in Italy with the, you know, with the prisons and everything else. It's just so many things, you know, so many things going on. But right now we are under orders to not go out. It's, I think officially they say it starts at 5 o'clock this evening. So I'm kind of on lockdown for a while. <sighs> This is my only connection to the outside world. <laughs> you know, I laugh because I'm keeping from crying. You know, it gets depressing sometimes. It really does. And that's the truth. 